In Fast Track Schedule 10, we have the ability to quickly and easily spot allocate resource work for numerous reasons. One such reason may be to eliminate over allocations of work that a resource has across any given project. And the project that we are currently viewing will notice that we have three resources, John, Bob, and Sue. To view additional information about the assignments each resource currently has, we can select Expand All from our toolbar. Doing this will show us additional graphs within each resource. We'll see that we have a percent work usage, an hourly work usage, and a graph representing the activities that each resource is currently assigned to. As we view Bob's graphs, we'll see some areas that have both red and green shading. What this indicates is that Bob has tasks that he's currently over assigned. What this means is that Bob is working double the amount of work that he's currently allowed to within a given day. We'll notice that within the activities, this is because activity two and activity three currently occur within the same dates. One way we can account for this is by using spot allocation to reassign the number of hours that Bob will be working on either activity. For example, let's say that on activity three, Bob is actually not going to be working the first five days. What this will mean is that we can place zero hours across each of the days from Monday to Friday on activity three. In order to do this, simply select the first day where hours appear, we can highlight, and then enter zero. Once we've entered zero, simply press tab to move to the next day on that given task. As we do this, you'll notice that the graph above automatically refreshes to now reflect the eight hours that Bob is working on activity two and zero hours that Bob is working on activity three. As we continue to do this across the task, we'll notice that each day once again updates, but when we reach our final day, Bob no longer has any over allocations so his graph above once again redraws to show that he is at 100% across all tasks that he is currently assigned to. As we've seen here, spot allocations can be used to easily modify any location where a resource currently has an over allocation within the project. Spot allocations give the project manager true control over the project and the ability to make changes at any point in time to our resources assigned.